not charging message from your laptop battery? For a free fix, try this easy battery calibration and see if it works for you. Okay, to start with, let's go ahead and do a shutdown on Windows. I'll come over here and click shutdown. And um, also make sure that your laptop is powered off. And we're going to go ahead and flip this over so that I can disconnect my AC plug from my laptop. And then I'm going to turn it around so I have access to my laptop battery. And I'm going to remove my battery from my laptop. And uh, let's go ahead and flip it back over and reinsert the uh, AC plug back into the laptop. All right, and uh, let's go ahead and power up uh, the laptop here and load Windows up. And once Windows uh, is finished loading and you have your desktop, click on the Start menu and go over to your Control Panel and uh, locate your Device Manager. Mine's up top here, and I'm going to click on it. And that opens up the Device Manager listings. And go down and find Batteries. And left-click with your mouse on the Batteries. And right-click and uninstall um, all of the Microsoft ACPI compliant control listings. And if you have more than one, that's okay. Go ahead and uninstall um, all of them that you see. Sometimes you'll have only one. Sometimes you'll see uh, more than one depending on your laptop uh, make and brand. Okay, um, let's go ahead and uh, go back to our desktop and do a shutdown on Windows. I'm going to click there. And uh, make sure your laptop is powered off. And uh, let's go ahead and close this and flip it over. And let's go ahead and disconnect the AC plug from our laptop. And now I'm going to go ahead and reinsert uh, my battery back into my laptop. And then I'm going to go ahead and reconnect the uh, AC plug back into my laptop here. Okay, um, I'm going to go ahead and turn the laptop on and uh, power it up and boot right into Windows. Okay, now that I have my desktop back up, I can see that I am at 88% plugged in and charging. So this battery calibration worked for me. Uh, give it a try. It may work for you. Okay, the last thing that you'll need to do is completely drain your battery and recharge it about three times. And um, this is a really important part. Allow the battery to cool down to room temperature between charges. Alright, that's it for this video.